guys, what's up? How's it going? It's Mark. Check it out. I'm just catching some shade right now under the big dang dog dang dirty monster truck. Anthony, how you like me now, brother? Catching some shade. Uh, so scope it out. I want to give you guys a little lowdown real quick. I got some new inventory coming up here soon. Four new pieces of inventory this week alone. Um, I've been guilty of driving this one precious gem right here for the past two weeks because I love it. Um, and it's been sitting in my garage, but I took the beast out. I unleashed the beast. You guys know what it is? You know me. You probably know what I'm gonna about to tell you in a second. Based on my wallet, based on my shirt, based on my son's own name. You ready? Check this beast out. Boom! 2007 Saline Mustang S281 Supercharged. Absolutely gorgeous car. You get the big saline brake calipers. It's number 368. Uh, it's supercharged. You get the louvered headrest, black saline seats with all saline and gray are uh, stitched into the seats. Absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous car. I'm getting it detailed up here soon and I'm going to be putting it up uh, on the interweb for sale. Super nice setup, guys. Really, really kick-ass car. Only has 13,000 miles on it. That's the killer. 13,000 miles. How could you beat that? I don't think there's one out there. Probably like one or two, maybe. You guys in, in the YouTube world are going to be like, oh, I found like a million of them on this site down in Nagasaki or wherever. But who cares? It's all good in the hood. It's a low mileage saline. And here's what's next on the list. Because you know me. Whenever I put the Sharpie in my mouth, it's time to operate. So what I'm doing is I'm building a Dirty Max. Yeah. You know why? Because it's Dirty Max season. And what we're going to build is a 2004 Chevrolet Silverado 2500 HD 6.6 liter Dirty Max. And why is she dirty? Because I just pulled these off. Look, I just pulled these off and I checked right here to make sure the door wasn't painted before I ripped these suckers off. I put them in the back of the bed right there to make sure they're good. I got the new headlights all changed out, guys. To, look at this. These are old head. Watch this. Hey, you guys, watch this. Ready? Watch this. Watch this. Ready? Dirty. 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 Old. Old. These are old headlights. You know what you do with old headlights? You kick them. And they're old. You know what I did? I got new tail lights. Why? Because new tail lights are better. Where'd they go? Where's the old new tail lights? Your music sucks, buddy. Look, where the hell are the new tail lights at? Oh, here we go. Look. There's the old tail lights. Check it out. They're just kind of, you know, after a while they get kind of ugly looking. So what I did is I put them brand new suckers on. They look gorgeous. Super, super nice setup. So check this out, guys. I'm going for a ultimately white outlook it's gonna look beast as hell might be throwing a set of chrome on here i'm probably throwing a set of chrome wheels what do you guys think so here's what i'm thinking let's take the sharpie and kind of draw on once you have a business plan once you have a build plan set in your mind and you kind of want to solidify things here's what you do you watch this you ready you straight once right you have a build plan set in mind i just got interrupted because i had somebody call me god dag nabbit so anyways once you have a build plan set in mind you just write right on top of it because why it's solidifying it white white all right white we're gonna go right here oh look who it is oh look who it is guys and youtubers Chevy, 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 Chevy. i want to punch that guy in the face because he's running around with my ford hat all right give me my ford hat and start filming i'm gonna give the camera to noah real quick but he's just running around i don't know where the hell he went where the hell he go oh there you go my head's soaking wet with sweat oh look what he just brought me a ford hat Woo! um so anyways i'm gonna set this right here on top of the chevy for chevy world uh, we're filming in reverse because Noah wasn't here. But what we're, we're telling Noah is we're, we're solidifying. We're doing the build plan. I decided to go all white with this truck. All white out. We're even painting the mirrors white. All right, we're taking these work mirrors off them and putting Dirty Max tow mirrors on that. All right, and painting those white. We're going to leave this accent piece on the grill right here that separates the upper and lower headlights and the grill. We're going to leave that chrome. So that's going to look nice. We're painting this, valance, or this upper valance trim piece of the bumper white. We're gonna paint this lower portion right here, white. We're gonna leave this section chrome. We're gonna paint this white. White. And we're gonna really do it up. Fender flares, white. And we're actually going to go above and beyond and not just switch out new wheels or new tires. It only needs new rear, it only needs new rear tires because the new fronts right here uh, are pretty 
I think it was probably about 55% tread. Uh, and guys, this truck is straight. What do you say it was from? California? I think it was Cal Arizona or California, I think it was. Um, super nice truck right here. Moog ball joints, brand new Moog ball joints, both sides. Um, and we're gonna get new wheels. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna write new because these are nasty looking. These are the Moto Metal 8s. I don't know what the hell those are. Those are old looking. So we're gonna switch it up. It's gonna look nice. Um, and we're gonna get a build, good build going on here, guys. Hope you like the video, subscribe. Um, where's the other, I said, I said four, didn't I? So, I try to uh, aim, fire. Make sure I don't hit myself. So we got uh, four coming in, right? what I say that? Four, yeah. So one, two, the saline. Oh, where's the truck at? Where's the dump truck at? Alignment. Oh, it's getting alignment. So we have a 2000, where is it? Uh, 2005 Ford F350. Check this out, guys. This truck was only used since brand new, since bought from the Ford dealership, only used at the local community college where it was taken out during the winter to plow the parking lot. And guess what? After they were done, they put it right back in the spot, lock it up, take the keys inside until next year. With that said, truck only has 6,363 miles on it. Super, super clean truck. It's a, uh, it's a dump truck. It's a single cab F350 dump truck. Uh, hydraulic bed, dump, electric bed, whatever you want to call it. Um, electric tailgate. It's really, really nice. Um, we'll be pricing that. I'd say like low, I'd say low 20s, maybe 20, 20 something. So if you guys know anybody, pass the word around. I'll be posting a video of it here soon. It's a really nice truck. And what's the other one we got in that we have over? 2004 Silverado. Silverado 1500. Yeah, I'll let you know. We got, no, I'll tell you guys about it. 2004. Chevy, Silverado, 1500, four wheel drive, the whole nine. Everything you want from a Silverado, boom, right it's there. It's probably gonna be priced around, I would say like, it's got a little bit of mileage on it as a trade-in, but what we're gonna do is we do the best we can for it to get it properly inspected, make sure everything's mechanically tip-top shape. Um, Cause that's what I do, is I'm tip-top shape with everything. Um, and that'll be priced around, I don't know, probably under five grand, I would say. Five grand, six grand, who knows. Check out the video. Hope you guys are doing well in YouTube land. Holler at me. This is Mark. See ya.